feel something building up inside me. I must prepare, I must get ready. Serving you, Yahweh, keeps me strong and steady for you. Lord, I'll go for green living. Living the way you meant for me to live is what I strive to do every day. As I live off the land, lead me at your pace for you. Lord, I'll go for green living. How's it going, guys? My last experiment did not work when I tried to just graft the different kinds of tomatoes right into the sides. So I'm going to try something different this time. I'm going to try grafting into the sucker of it. So I'm going to go right there to that one, and right there to that one. First thing I want to do, first thing I did was I topped this, and so that it encouraged it to head to suckers, but I'm going to take off a few of these extra leaves. I don't want it supporting anything but the grafts. Come up the 45 right there. And I got a, a blueberry right here. I just went and took off the off the sucker off of a, our bigger plants. See if I can do this. Oh, that looks like it match up pretty good. So, Let's slide that on. Even it out. Yeah, it looks pretty good from all angles. This one right here, it looks about big enough too, so I have a sausage tomato cutting ready for that too. So take my brand new razor blade. And I want to cut about right there. Oh yeah, that's good. This one I want to cut off right there. Right. That's going to match up pretty good. If I can zoom up on that cut, two cuts. Oh, you see how they fit right together? I have a little nursery area right below my work table. It's uh, just a 10 gallon aquarium. And I put this in there for about a week, it gets very little light. So I'll try to see if this these two will work. Cucumber patch. A couple of white ones. They're way over my head now. Reaching for the sky. I hope he makes it up there before it falls down. Just gotta kinda look for the cucumbers, but there's one right there. Start to fill out a little further in. A few bigger ones down there at the bottom. Over there. It's a huge one. Somehow a squash got here. And it's just huge. Tomatoes are doing excellent.
They all got nice little clusters of tomatoes on them. Some more than others. Some of them are doing things that I've never seen before. Look at a little sunburn there. But that brandy wine right there, let me zoom in just a little bit. That brandy wine right there, the top of it is just a big cluster of blooms. There's there's no blooms all the way down. If you can see back there, but up the top is 33 blooms as the top of the plant. Of course, I've never seen that before, but I might say the seeds from that one. Do some cloning, grafting, see what we can come up with. This one is unusual too. Nope. Oh, sorry, wrong way. It sent out on every sucker. It sent out blooms. I mean, it's just very unusual tomatoes, but I'm pretty impressed. Uh, these are uh, they came out of an heirloom blend. I'm not sure exactly what they are, but. Sure, we'll find out soon. I know right down there is Parks Whoppers, and they're doing great down there. I got some ox hearts I can recognize from the shapes they're coming right there. Let's see if I can get a little closer. Oh, yeah. I wanted to show you some of these heirloom squash and the leaves on there. I mean, literally. <laughs> Come on now. But it's about eight foot high right now. I'm growing strong. I'm gonna let it do what it's gonna do. Got some butternut squash there and some cantaloupes. And this is the Malabar spinach. It's, it's climbing up there now. Of course my bigger squash. Zucchini, straight neck, crook neck squash. Sneak peek at the pavilion. Live in the way you meant for me to live. Is what I strive to do every day. As I live off the land, lead me at your pace for you. Lord, I'll go for green living. Help me to feed all the hungry. Use me, Lord, to ease their misery. From all this worldly pain and captivity. For you, Lord, I'll go for green living. I feel something building up inside me. <laughs> I must prepare. I must get ready Serving you, Yahweh Keeps me strong and steady For you, Lord, I'll go for green living For you, Lord, I'll go for green living